Hi everyone, hope you're doing okay. Just another update really on where we're at, how things are changing uh, rapidly. Hope you're keeping well. Just a few things to, to keep you informed about. Firstly, earlier in the week we talked about the youth and children's work that was still going to go ahead this Friday because the schools are still open. Of course, now all that has changed. We did decide yesterday that we were going to say that children's and youth work wasn't going to happen this week. Uh, and it isn't, so that will be no more youth and children's work until further notice. Things are changing very, very quickly, and we're doing the, our best to respond at this end as quickly as we can to those changes. Just to keep you updated about the care group, how that's coming along, thank you so much for all the requests that you've made known to us, all the offers of help, all the stuff that's going on. It's really brilliant the way folks are looking after each other caring for each other keep an eye on each other please do keep that up please it's really helpful for us if you communicate what you're doing um, to us via steve duffield or paul forrest so they those guys can keep uh, an overview of what's going on of who's doing what and the list that we're trying to combine which involves people's need um, and who can meet that need is is coming together and hopefully in the next day or so that list will be complete and we'll be able to start coordinating what we're doing uh, so it's as effective and efficient as possible but yeah thank you so much for all your offers of help and support thank you also as well for the messages of encouragement um, that we've been getting it's it's really uh, brilliant and we really feel your prayers uh, and support so thank you so much for that in terms of what's going on in the week from monday There'll be no bookings going on in the week and to all intents and purposes, Bridge Chapel in the week uh, will be closed to bookings and to events. There are a small number of people still using office space, uh, but yeah, from Monday, uh, Esther's will be closed and the the operations during the week will, will also stop until further notice. Again, any changes, any updates, we'll do our best to communicate them in as timely way as we can. And then finally, just thinking about Sunday, you know, in the letter and in the video, we talked about live streaming uh, and the possibility of that and how that would look and what Sunday would look like. As we've looked into that, it's become apparent that there are some difficulties with licensing and singing songs and broadcasting them and putting them on the internet and on web pages and stuff like that. We're still looking into that and thoughts are still ongoing. It is our intention to do something on Sunday, what that is going to look like, how that's going to be just now, we're not quite sure. Ideally, we'd love it to be like a normal as we can service with some songs and Bible reading and prayer and then a talk. Uh, but we're really uh, not sure yet what that's going to look like. There's still some technical stuff to put in place uh, at this end. And also we need to look into the licensing stuff. So we're really clear on that. So yeah, I think that's all for now. Like I said, we'll, we'll keep you updated with some more of these uh, video bulletins and put them on the website and share them on social media um, so you can, you can be as involved and updated as you want to be. If you need anything, please uh, feel free to email admin at bridgechapel.com. Use the centre number 0151281 or the care line number which is 0151281950 uh, or drop a message via social media and then we'll we'll do our best to communicate back to you as soon as we can thanks everyone please do keep praying uh, remember luther's quote from the time of the plague let us trust god act wisely and love one another and we'll speak to you again shortly thank you